Hi friends, Shayla here. So I'm here to kick off a new video for you. So today, as you can see behind me, my shelves are all sorts of a mess. And so I'm gonna take some time today kind of reorganizing some things, cleaning things up in here and getting things all fresh. And I thought I'd take you guys along on the journey with me. So I'm gonna pull you off the tripod here for a second and we're gonna kind of go over some of the things that I'm changing or have started changing. So to start off, um, I had a bunch of mass market paperbacks up here that were more my husband's than mine. And so I actually shifted those into our office, which is on the other side of this wall, and freed up an entire shelf here. And then I had all my classics down here. I still have a stack that I need to move. But I also moved out uh, my Harry Potter collection. I've, again, moved that into the office because that doesn't need to be displayed on my shelf here. So I moved the classics up here, and then the other stack of classics that I've got here, I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to put them. <laughs> So I really like the look of that middle grade shelf there with the secret garden facing out like that because that book means so much to me. This is my childhood copyright here. I don't know if I've shown this in a video, so I probably should. I know I've shown it on my Instagram, but I'm going to sneakily pull this out. This is my thrashed two bits childhood copy of the secret garden because I read this over and over and over again. I mean, like... I thrashed this book and it's just well loved and well worn and it just means the world to me to actually have this in my collection. I'll put that back a little bit later. We're going to put that right there for now. But anyways, so that's kind of the situation. I also shifted some like our Lord of the Rings collection is kind of hodgepodge. So I moved that into the office as well. So this is primarily my Sanderson shelf. Rhythm of War came out today. Um, and that's where Starsight goes, but I need to make room for Rhythm of War. So I'm gonna shift things and things are gonna have to change a little bit, obviously, because it's such a beefy book. And then, you know, like my whole romance section here is like a complete and utter mess. So, we're gonna do some organizing. I do think I'm gonna take this Lost Fleet series and also take that into the office because I feel like all the stuff kind of like that got shifted in there. So I think I'm gonna take that in there as well. So this is gonna be the journey. I'm gonna speed you guys up and play some pretty, pretty music and we'll chat when I've got something to say. Okay, so I've now updated this shelf. I've left a little room here for some or other fantasy things as they come in. And obviously this is my Sanderson shelf minus these th four books. And then I didn't really touch anything on this shelf. I'd recently kind of reorganized that. Um, I did do some maneuvering here, ended up stacking the Fable Haven books and kind of filling in that space a little bit better. And then what I did down here, is because some books were able to shift from here up there that I ended up shifting things over. And then all of these were previously on this bottom shelf. And so I shifted them up here, put them in a stack and then kind of filled in the gaps with book of the month books. And then the rest of the book of the month books are there. And then some of the ones that were over here are now under here, as well as my whole comic and graphic novel collection which is really puny and tiny right now, but I do plan on changing that. And then 
up here. I moved the classics here because I was able to clear off this entire shelf. And then I kind of took some that were on this shelf before and left them there. Um, put some things here after shifting some things around and didn't do too much to the shelf other than putting a few things there. And then this shelf, I shifted a little bit, not too much. And that completely freed up this bottom shelf, which is great because now my romance collection has room to spread out because right now it's just cluttered and too close together. So that's the next phase we're gonna move on because I freed up two entire big shelves here. So I'd love to move the ones off the top down into an actual shelf, but I'm gonna do a lot of shifting around. So let's get to it. Okay, so I was able to shift a lot of things. Things feel tidier now. And that bottom, this shelf here, is my Christine Feehan collection, plus some extras, and then just my TARDIS and my little Dr. Ten. More paranormals down there. Shifted paranormals that were here, because now that's historical. Shifted them over here, so it looks like bottom then top. I decided to leave these here for now, because I had space. And then I shifted the entire rainbow shelf, added a few things back in, and then the bottom shelf is still open, just how I like it for now. So when it comes to the book side of things, I think I'm pretty good for now. I'm feeling pretty good about all of the tweaks and changes that I made. It feels tidier and cleaner, and like I still have some room on the shelf, which is really good because I was feeling like I didn't have room. So that is much better. I'm sure soon you will see a manga version of the same thing, but I don't think I'm gonna do it in the same video just because I really think different people will wanna see different sides of it. So that's my plan. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. How often do you reorganize your collection? And I will see you guys in the next video.